In the first instalment, we looked at the theory of reverberation and described how the acoustics of a room have a major impact on the quality of conferencing audio. In this video, we're going to put that theory to the test. To demonstrate the effects of reverberation, we're going to hear how this microphone sounds in a number of different acoustic environments. In each, we're going to measure the reverberation time in seconds and compare that against our target of about 0.5 seconds. For example, inside this little booth, the reverberation time is about 0.3 seconds. Now, let's see if we can eliminate it entirely, and we're going to do that by removing our walls and ceiling completely. Well, certainly our reverb time is great, but without walls, there's nothing here to protect us from the noise. Plus, it's a little bit cold, and also might get a little bit wet, so it's not exactly ideal. Perhaps we'll try somewhere indoors. Okay, so we're indoors, but you can probably hear the effect of reverberation on my voice already. Because this space has mostly hard surfaces that are relatively far apart, it suffers from a long and strong reverberance. Maybe we can try somewhere that has the walls a little closer together. In here, the surfaces are certainly closer together, but they're still all hard and acoustically reflective. So it sounds like, I mean, well, so we really need some soft furnishings in here to bring the reverberation time down. I think I have an idea. Excuse me. Yes, that's much better. But I guess it's no surprise that a cinema, which is purpose designed for audio, sounds pretty good. So the question is, how do we achieve this kind of result in a conference room without it looking like a recording studio or a cinema? Surprisingly, it's not that difficult. Taking this room as an example, it has a carpeted floor, absorptive ceiling tiles, and acoustic wall panelling material along two walls. With all of that, it achieves a reverberation time of approximately 0.4 seconds, which is quite acceptable for conferencing. So how does the reverb time in your conference room compare? Remember, room acoustics are important, and getting it right will make it easier and more effective to get your message across in your conferences. If you think your room looks or sounds like it may have a reverb problem, talk to your AV system integrator or consultant about how it can be improved.